everybody, my name is Janae Toy and this is my channel where I talk about whatever I want. Yeah, so I've got a new outfit on. <laughs> I thought that having the whole YouTube outfit was kind of, eh, a bit silly. But I was kind of preparing myself for my trip where I'd have to wear the same thing every day. It's like having a YouTube costume, as it were, kind of felt right for that. But, yeah, um... Also, do you like the skirt? I got it cheap. I got it for like a tenner. Um, that was it. Right. I came on to tell you today <laughs> that the plan has changed a lot since me being here at my nan's and recovering. Originally, I wanted to get going on my trip again on the 11th, the day after my violin concert which they told us that we're not allowed to put online, unfortunately. So that's sad, but oh well. Um, but yeah, at that point, it was like a week after I'd been taken out of the leg brace and I couldn't walk on it without a bit of pain every so often. Then it was going to be the 24th. So I guess either yesterday or last week, depending on whenever I put this video up. Um, it was going to be the 24th of July and I'd be like, yeah, I'm going back and that didn't work because I'm still getting pain every time I lean down to, um, put my tent away or, you know, put it up. So that's not great. And I tried walking, um, today around Roxham without my, um, walking boots and just with regular old shoes that don't have the extra fluffy padding and now my ankle hurts like hell so I'm basically working with what I have which isn't a lot but a few other things have been kind of put in place as well for instance my dad and I were talking and when I was on that bus ride to Cromer to go walking I had to go through a part of, part of the city that's very central but also I feel very sick whenever I'm whenever I'm going through that part of the city because it's got a lot of trauma and bad memories associated with it to the point where I can't even go through that part of the city without feeling like I'm going to be sick so, my dad and I are working on getting me to move house. I'm 19 and I'm going to be hopefully getting my own place. I have no idea what that'll look like, when it's going to happen. But my dad said, before you go back on your trip, I want you to get your own place so that you don't have to come back to Norwich and feel sick every time that you're coming home. Because he doesn't want me feeling, well he doesn't want me feeling sick at home, you know, so I, I appreciate my dad, he's helping me draft an email to um, a few local councils, so that's interesting. Other life updates, um, system is finished for the year, now I've got to wait for the next academic year, I've got to wait through the six week holiday, that should be fun. Um, but I'm still practicing my violin. Always will be, always have been, always will be. <laughs> I said always will be twice. But yeah, um, system is finished for the year and they're looking for a bigger venue. So anywhere around Norwich that's a bigger venue for Systema, we are looking for you. <laughs> um, but yeah, because the orchestra is getting bigger we can't do it, you know, as an after school club anymore, like in the schools. And of course, I'm no longer in school. <sighs> the simpler times when I was back in school. I hated school, <laughs> but simpler times. But yeah, um, so System is basically waiting for a bigger venue and looking for a bigger venue so that they can have more kids in a big space. And I look forward to seeing what they do with it. But I'm not sure if I'll be able to go back there. 
they will always be special in my heart. I love Sistema dearly. It's been, it's been my family for over a decade and they've looked after me really well. And I owe them my life, you know? So I will always, always be promoting Sistema. Always, always, always. If I ever do like, if I ever get big enough to be doing charity live streams or whatever, you better believe that I'm going to be raising money for Sistema because I believe in what they do. They gave me a life, they gave me a home, they gave me a family, they gave me a skill. You know, I play my violin and it's a skill, my dudes. You know, so Sistema gave me a great start in what would have otherwise been a terrible life. <laughs> I, you know, I've said this before, but I genuinely do not believe I would be here if it weren't for Sistema. I wouldn't be alive today if it weren't for Sistema because I had some really rough patches in my life. So if you can, if you are willing to either donate some money or an instrument to Sistema or any of the local branches that you have around the UK, do it. <laughs> you know, because they do great work. As for other things that are happening more in my life, um, yeah, I said about me possibly, hopefully, getting out of Norwich. Norwich. <laughs> but, um, yeah, at the moment I'm just basically trying to wait till my ankle heals and then I'm going to get walking again. As soon as I can get walking, I will get walking. And I have been walking, I promise you that. Um, but yeah, I just... It's been a while since I've recorded a video. I've forgotten how to do this, okay? <laughs> but I'm about seven minutes in, so I guess if you like this video, leave a like. Comment something nice, you know, if you have any advice for me. Any, like, you know, tidbits of knowledge that you can share. Please do, because I need all the help I can get at the moment. Um, <laughs> yeah, and share this video with your friends so that everyone knows what's going on. And subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next video some other time. <laughs> Bye, YouTube!